time ago, um, and I was I was young, um, and I was I always remember when we went to Hong Kong that I was I was always shattered just with trying to deal with the the, the, the time, um, but I, I enjoyed it ever so much, um, I, and I got the nod to come on and and we were playing good football at the time, fortunate for me on 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 the on the day, and um, I was fortunate enough to score two goals as well. And my first boys club was called Goodyear um, and if I'm honest I can't really remember my coach <laughs> um, so I hope he's not watching. Um, it's a hard one actually. The always one that just comes to my memory is obviously my debut. I scored when I played to my debut for Rangers and it was a great memory for me um, coming on as a sub and, and scoring so that's probably the one that I always remember. Um, there was a boy called actually Frankie Brody and he was a striker. Um, he was great with his head. It was easy for me because I just put the crosses in and he always scored with his head. So it was a boy called Frankie Brody. Um, the first football strip my dad bought me, I think it was, a, it was actually not my dad, I think it was my uncle. Um, he bought me a Scotland strip. Um, I would probably say I, sh I shared a room a lot with um, Gavin Ray um, at Cardiff and sometimes he was prone to snoring when he took a sleeping tablet. Um, I've been fortunate enough to play with a lot of good players um, and when I was at Rangers when you've got you know, Ronald De Boer, um, Frank De Boer, um, Claude uh, Penigia. Um, but I think in his, um, his prime, I think Barry Ferguson was a fantastic player. Um, not just technically, but you know he always wanted to win, even if it was in training. I would probably say Ashley Cole. Um, we played a friendly Rangers against Arsenal. Um, playing against him was, was, it was, it was good to play against him. Um, I'd probably make homemade lasagna, I'm quite good at that. Um, I know it's quite simple and easy, but you can always add things into it and put a bit of spice into it as well, so probably homemade lasagna. Last gig I did was, I think it might have been the Jay-Z and Kanye West concert in London at the O2 Arena. Um, it, was, it was a very good concert, I enjoyed that very much. I'd probably say uh, last year I went with the kids to Turkey and um, it was great, they were very friendly, the food was great and you know the hospitality was great as well and the kids loved it, they had so many flumes to play in and they had you know, baby, baby pools and that as well so and we met nice people there as well, you always meet you know other Scottishmen don't you? Um, I'd fortunate to have a few obviously you keep your strips over the years, and um, but you know, for the first time when I was at Rangers, you know, I, I, I won Player of the Year, and you know that's probably the, the, because it was the first one that was probably most important to me. Um, probably X Factor. I don't know. I, I always like Formula One, so I'd probably say somebody like Lewis Hamilton or something for that because it's. It's, 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 it's a great sport um, and I enjoy watching it as well, so I'd probably say him. Oh, on my phone. And if I get the chance to play on my phone, my kids are usually playing it. Um, I, I like the movie app where you have to guess what the movie is from the picture. I think that's quite good. Um, I think I've got, it's called Say What You See as well, and it's just a canvas and you have to pick uh, what, what, what movie it is or what song. Um, through, through a picture, so I kind of like um, the ones.